Welcome to today's webinar, which is brought to you by District 180 in the Office of Continuous Improvement and Support in the Kentucky Department of Education. This webinar will provide more guidance on how to use and navigate the school-based decision-making SBDM training materials necessary for training SBDM council members. Our agenda is on the screen. During this webinar, we will discuss the purpose of the training materials, review the contents included in each training module, and discuss what work needs to be done before, during, and after the training. Let's start with looking at the purpose of the training materials. Pursuant to KRS 160.345, all SBDM council members must receive annual training relating to the process of school-based decision-making. New members must receive six hours, and members who have served at least a year on council must receive three hours training. KDE has developed training materials for both new and experienced council members. These materials are free for all endorsed trainers to use when training council members. New members should receive training on the Introduction to SBDM module, and experienced members have a variety of KDE training modules to choose from. To become an endorsed SBDM trainer, participants must attend an annual SBDM training hosted by KDE to learn the most up-to-date information regarding training materials and SBDM council roles and responsibilities. A list of endorsed trainers can be found within the hyperlink. Now we are going to talk about the contents included in each training module. Each training module includes a facilitator's guide, participant's guide, PowerPoint presentation, supplemental materials for activities, and an evaluation. Each facilitator's guide consists of the following. A script, which includes examples of what the trainer should say and when, an answer key for any of the activities in which the participants will engage, and a timeline suggesting how long to spend on each section of the training. In addition to the facilitator's guide, the training module also includes a participant's guide that will be given to each member participating in that training. This guide mirrors the facilitator's guide and allows participants an opportunity to follow along and take part in discussions and activities. This is a great resource for members to take notes on, write in the answers, and keep for reference. Next, let's look at some training ideas for consideration. Prior to conducting the SBDM training, KDE encourages you to do the following. Read through the facilitator's guide thoroughly to get a clear understanding of what you will need to say and do. In the facilitator's guide, anything in blue is either an answer to an activity, information the trainer will want the participants to think about, and or information the trainer will need to know him or herself. Anything in red is what the facilitator will say to transition or to start a conversation. Prior to the training, trainers should print materials needed for the training, including the guides, activities, sign-in sheets, and evaluations. All materials needed are found on the front of your facilitator's guide. You will also want to ensure technology is available for any activity and for displaying the PowerPoint. If you are preparing for your first training at the location you will be training, make sure you are familiar with the location of the restrooms, water fountains, vending machines, and where to go in case of an emergency. Try to get to your location early so you can prearrange the space conducive to your training if necessary. On the training day, have participants sign into the training. This information will be passed along to the district contact responsible for entering council data into the verification database. Next, hand out the necessary materials for successfully participating in the training session. During the training, engage participants through a variety of activities such as conversations, hands-on activities, think, pair, share, and group presentations. Once the training is complete, allow time for questions, suggestions, or further clarifications. As always, if you receive a question with which you are uncertain of the answer, please contact the SBDM consultant at KDE for assistance. An ELO will need to be given to each participant, and the sign-in sheet will need to be given to the district's SBDM coordinator for proper record keeping. Now we are going to look at an experienced member training module so you can see what the format looks like. All training modules have the same format. We will break down the facilitator's guide first and then glance at the participant's guide. Every facilitator's guide will begin with an introduction that includes useful information the trainer will need to know. Then a sample agenda is provided as well as needed materials for the training. 
As you can see in blue here, this information gives guidance to the trainer of the first steps the participants will need to do to begin the training. On page two, you will see in red the word say. This is a suggestion of what the trainer can say at this point and then guiding directions follow. Under getting started, each scenario is given and sample answers are suggested in blue. The training modules are very detailed and provide specific directions. Remember, make the training work for you and your council by spending more or less time on, on an activity or topic as needed. Towards the end of the module, you will see a paragraph to conclude the training and next steps at that point. As you will see with the participants guide, it looks the same as the facilitator's guide, but without answers, guidance, or a script. The page numbers on both guides match up and following along should be easy. Thank you for participating in today's webinar. You have been provided with a brief overview of the SBDO training materials and how to use them effectively. Should you have any further questions about training, please contact the SBDO consultant in the Office of Continuous Improvement and Support at 502-564-3791. Thank you.